Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. Um, I wanted to share with you a really quick um, happy mail I received today. Um, this is actually from April Olander Designs. Um, so April did some fun um, Maggie Holmes like kits. Um, and I forgot if this is for, I don't remember if it's for Paracel or if it was just like a, several different Maggie Holmes things. Um, but anyway, I haven't even looked at it yet. It just came today. Um, it's starting to get dark, so hopefully it's light enough. But uh, yeah, let's get started. So um, I love how she did this in the pink tissue with this really sweet little bow. Um, so let's see what's inside. Oh my gosh, so pretty. Okay, so here is April's um, card. So she's April Olander Designs, um, dot com. So she um, has several things on that um, website for sale. Um, she has an Instagram shop, which is at aprilolander.designs. Her Instagram is at Crafty Creations by April. She also has a YouTube channel, April Olander, and it looks like Facebook as well. So, oops, sorry, I'm a little out of frame, but I love this card, April, if you're watching. So, so cute. So we'll put that there and then, oh, look at all this really cute shred. Oh my gosh, this is beautiful. So she did a lot of like sneak peeks of what was gonna be um, in the kit and um, everything is just so super cute. Um, okay, so, oh, look at, she gave me a little chocolate. These are actually my favorite. So thank you so much for that, April. And then look, you guys, at this. <gasps> Oh, wow. Okay, so she did several types of rosettes. Oh my gosh, so cute. Okay, so let's start with these. Um, these are super cute. Okay, I'm gonna try to open this all so you guys can see it close up. Um, she did some really cute bows. Um, love that pink. And then there's a little like a lighter pink kind of glittery bow. And then look at the sweet little mint one. And then look at this one, you guys. Oh my gosh, those are so adorable. And then she did a little black and white stripe. So this is very like kind of carousel colors. Um, also, um, oh, Bloom. This is like makes me think of Bloom. Um, but yeah, I think there's like a couple different um, papers and stuff that she used so those are super cute and then oh, I don't know where to start okay so then let's do this um so I won't open this one because it is sealed but isn't that so cute so she did a little bag topper with um two different doilies and then um just added some fun little like distressed um circle that she punched out of some I think that's actually bloom paper uh, it might be Chasing Dreams, I can't remember. But anyway, those are so pretty. Look at the um, the heart. I love the little word fetty. Super, super cute. Um, and she did these. Aren't those funny? Or not funny, fun. These little like fluffy. I was trying to say fluffy and fun. Um, look at those rosettes. Or they're, actually they're like little rosette flowers. So... Um, Tina Marie, which is Mrs. Evely, does some of these as well. Um, she sent me some of those before, but aren't those so cute? I love them. I love they're just really nice and chunky. And then she does the little floral um, centers. Super cute. Cute, cute, cute. And then, um, sorry, my kids are in the kitchen. If you can hear them, they're cooking food. So... And um, then she did this little um, sequin mix. So, so fun. Yeah, kind of like Chasing Dreams too. I think this is very Chasing Dreams. And this one's very Carousel. Oh my gosh, that's the thing I love about Maggie Holmes though is so many of the collections can kind of intermix, you know. Um, Ooh, that is so cute. So she did these little butterflies. So I've made these before as well, but I love how she actually stitched them with her sewing machine. Um, so, so fun. And then she popped them up. Let's see, I'll show you that outside of the bag. She actually popped them up. So she took, she cut um, gold paper. So kind of a textured gold. 
and then did a layer of like a pink vellum and then the, the pattern paper and then she just stitched it down the center. So when you put them on your project, you can kind of fluff these up. And then, um, yeah, they'll be like really, really cute um, on your project. So super, super fun. Love, love, love that. And then I'll show you the other rosette. So I love how, April, how you did um, several different styles of rosettes. And honestly, I <clears throat> know how to make rosettes, but I mean, they're still my favorite to make. And I, you always make such gorgeous ones. So I have purchased this type from you before and I love them. And um, yeah, these are gorgeous as well. Oh, I love that, you guys. Look at how dimensional that is. So you could do some really fun, chunky embellishments with those and beautiful colors. So, 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 so cute. Love those. And then these, oh, these are always my favorite. Um, so April sells these, you know, in her shop. So you'll want to check it out. Um, she does the most perfect rosettes and I think you can buy them either with glitter or without. So, um, I don't know if you can see that, but see how the edges are glittered. So they're very thick, how she does them with her crepe paper. Um, and then she keeps them un unembellished for you, which is perfect. And then you can just kind of play around and, you know, do, do whatever you'd like with them. But Look at these colors. They're just very sherbery or sherbet-y. I don't know how you say that. Um, love those. And oh my gosh, look at this, you guys. It's just so much goodness. And then um, she included a little bead mix. Let me see if I have a little dish that I could oh. put these in. Okay, hold on. Um, Oh, so fun, super fun. Um, so I'll show you those close up, but lots of fun little colors. Love this little polka dot and these little sparkly. Love the stripes. So yeah, lots of super, super, sorry. Hopefully you guys can see that, but really, really fun. And then um, the other thing, oops, she included is um oh how cute are these okay so she did some um oh what's it called you guys um like shrinky dink charms i think that's what these are so let's see if we can actually i think i'm gonna have to hold these in my hand because it's too shadowy oh my gosh these are so cute so yeah she used the white um shrinky dink stuff and then she did a bow, and then there's the sweet flower. Got the butterfly. And look at that sweet deer. Oh my gosh. So I know for sure these are from Carousel here. Um, oh my gosh, I don't know some of these collections. I can't think of them off the top of my head. That one's Carousel there. Yeah, but she did like these little bunnies. Um, oh, I don't know if that's Garden Party. Um, oh yeah, I think this is Garden Party. Isn't that so cute? Look at this little cake. And then look at this little, um, what's one of the little cut aparts from Carousel? But aren't those adorable? Oh my gosh, these are so fun. Those are, I think, are my favorite. Oh my gosh. Okay. So what an amazing kit. I can't remember. I'm pretty sure this was like $35 for this entire kit, which is like, honestly, a super amazing, um, value because this, like you could tell April really put her heart and soul into this and there's so much here. Um, but yeah, definitely worth it. April, thank you for, so much for curating this collection. You did a great job. I absolutely love it. And you guys definitely check her out. Um, check her shop out. And then um, you can follow her on Inst Instagram as well um, to see you know, some of the fun stuff that she's making and selling. All right, you guys. Thanks for stopping by. Have a great day.